What up guys, I'm in Nashville right now, I'm about to go to sleep, but I wanted to make a little video for you guys because I haven't made one in a couple days. So, it is about 3am, I got to the hotel probably around 9, I've been working on a lot of stuff. I have a comedy video coming out for y'all tomorrow, and I'm going to try and get it up around noon or 1pm central time, which means... 2 p.m. ish Eastern or 11 Western. And if you're international, I have no idea. But it'll be up probably over within like 12 hours. How's that? That doesn't help any of you. Uh, this is the hotel room. It's um, it's pretty cool. There's all to myself. There's another bed here, but it's just me. We're going to be here. It's kind of a fancy hotel in downtown Nashville. I'm going to be here about three days, I think. Call it. <laughs> be here about three days, and then I'm going to move to a different hotel for the rest of the time that I'm here. we got YouTube conference coming up. It's for music creators, because that's what Nashville's all about. And Nashville's awesome, too. But the conference is on Thursday. Today is Tuesday, technically Wednesday. Tomorrow night, uh, on Wednesday night, I've got this little dinner thing I'm going to go to. Then Thursday's the event. And then I'm still in town through Tuesday, meeting people, maybe working with some producers or songwriters, and uh, just getting a feel for Nashville. It's pretty. It's a pretty cool town so far. Um, it's kind of like Texas meets... Los Angeles. It's country. It's wide open, lots of green, lots of huge yards and trees and uh, very Midwest, East Coast kind of openness and Texan Southern openness. Um, lots of country music, real casual, laid back people. But it's very industry too. Like, you know, uh, my friend who was driving me around was telling me, like, you know, we're driving down the street, and it's all houses, and, like, they look like normal houses. And he's like, yeah, these are, like, you know, where major record studios are, and major publishers in the world, and, you know, like, this is Studio B, where Elvis recorded all his big hits. And uh, it's just, like, it's like they, they converted a church into a recording studio. And then right next, that's Studio A, and then right next to it is a house, I think, and that's Studio B. And uh, it's just awesome. So, like, it's a huge industry, but it's very casual, laid back. There's, like, a coffee shop near this college campus, and apparently Taylor Swift goes there pretty often. I don't know, it's just cool. I, I'm actually kind of thinking I really like Nashville. I might want to move here. Um, L.A. is good for me getting my start with everything, but I don't think it's where I want to like raise a family or settle down, so maybe Nashville. I'll come back and look at this vlog again in like two or three years, see what happens. So anyways, um, my mom was in town, and we got my car back and everything. Uh, the car situation, for those of you who don't know, my car got towed on last Wednesday, and I found out on Thursday and it was really nobody's fault um it's just I, I can't remember if i told you this or not it's really nobody's fault it's just that uh the registration had expired my mom had moved around uh changing where she lived and we think that the letter notifying her about the ex expired tags just didn't make it to her and so she didn't know i didn't know the car was registered in her name and then uh, the police found it and impounded it, and uh, they didn't give. Normally, apparently, they, they usually give a warning, but they didn't, which you know, it's unfortunate, but it's legal. So, and then I couldn't get the car out or even like access it because I wasn't on the registration. So legally, I had no connection to the car, and she was in Germany, and she had to come. She was a flight attendant for Delta. So she had to come back and take care of all this stuff. And so we spent all day Monday taking care of it and got 
so much done in such a short amount of time. We worked on it for like seven hours. We started working on it at 7.30 a.m. We walked out the house. First we went to the police station. Then we went to the impound because we had to get permission to get access to the car. So we went to the impound, got access to it, wrote down the odometer. Then we went to the DMV and we actually get to go to AAA a DMV instead. And uh, they took care of us a lot, and they're like, actually, there's some other stuff that you have to do. Go do this. So then we went back to the police station, got access to get the car, permission to get the car out. Went to the DMV, went to the impound lot, got the car out. Went back to AAA, finished up all that. And all that took about seven hours. So long story short, I got my car back. Yay. $700 later. 500 of which was impound fees. Ugh. And I got a new license plate. I now have registration. I have a registered car. I own a car now. Yeah. I'm rich. And uh, it's good stuff. And then I flew out. I stayed up. Uh, let's see. My mom. Was that today? Oh my goodness. That was yes. That was literally yesterday. Literally yesterday. And uh, then I stayed up all night editing this comedy video, which will be going up tomorrow. Hope you guys like it. I think it's I think it's good. I think it's good. Something I've been talking about. Finally got it done. And uh, then uh, got into town, got picked up. Drove around a little bit, went by the office for the people who were setting up this event, hung out with them, went to go to a recording studio and hung out, uh, took like a three hour nap there, because I was exhausted, because I stayed up all night, and uh, then came to the hotel, worked on my videos tonight, got caught up on things, now here we are, you and me, in bed together. You're looking at my arm, down my arm. Oh, and this is my thumb. That looks, the shot's kind of weird. Is that better? That's weird, too. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm just going to upload this while I go to sleep. I hope it finishes. I still need to upload that second half of the Easter basket that my mom sent me. She thought that I was opening it up. Or I had opened it up when she visited. It's late at night. My thoughts are scattered. Is there anything else I want to tell you about? Being here is really inspiring. Watching professionals work on music. It's pretty cool. Um... Good to see you. I need to shave. I need to get a haircut. You guys are awesome. Um, Nash end of Nashville vlog part one. Tomorrow we shall vlog again. Maybe I'll walk around downtown and show you downtown. Sound good? I'll try. All right. Have a great night. Let me go cuddle with this pillow. Bye.